Hi there and welcome to our video for the second Sunday in Lent. This morning or this afternoon I have three or four really important pieces of information to share and you know I'm, I'm on that topic I'm always on the lookout for different ways and opportunities to share information in a timely manner with you. The first piece of information is that over the last couple of years we've had a wonderful person in the parish, Bernadette Bain, who has been producing our e-newsletter and placing all our content on our website. Bernadette Bain has been working from home for most of, those, uh, most of that time and she is uh, retiring from her role. And so I just wanted to publicly say thank you, Bernie, for all the wonderful work that you have done and the way you present information in a way that is both attractive and engaging. Uh, so I'm, I'm really grateful for everything that you've done. The second piece of information is that in kind of replacement for Bernie is we've got a new employee in our office, Erin Osborne. Now you might already know Erin, she did NET last year in Darwin, she's one of our parishioners, and she's come on board in the office in a part-time capacity to assist Vicky, uh, also to do the digital stuff. Erin uh, is uh, very soon going to be 21 years old, so she's a digital native, and also to assist our volunteers in the parish office. Thirdly, I'm in pretty serious conversation at the moment with a person in Brisbane who may be the right person for our parish director or coordinator of evangelization. Now, I'm really excited about this because you might remember back in Lent last year, a year ago, Father Francis and I preached for a couple of weeks in each place on increasing our giving so that we could hire some new staff. And it's just, it's wonderful that after a year I can finally put this plan into action because I know that you've consistently responded. Now the deal breaker, or the rather the deal maker, for hiring this director of evangelization, since they're Brisbane based, is to find a one or two bedroom unit to rent here in Caloundra. I repeat that, I'm looking for a one or a two bedroom unit to rent here in Caloundra. And I just wanna place that information in this forum so that, um, and invite you to take that to prayer. Do you or does someone that you know have some accommodation that the parish can lease long term? for the director of evangelization. If we can get this person, they are the exact right person for the role. And so I wanna invite you to pray about that as I am. Exciting stuff. There's a lot going on. We've got a lot of changes happening here in the office with not just the hiring of staff, but uh, digitizing and modernizing all our processes at the moment, our processes rely on our staff and volunteers simply knowing what to do. We've got nothing really written down anywhere. And so as well as digitizing and reprocessing everything, we're also looking at the implementation of a new database, a digital database to be much more efficient in collecting and using information. Friends, it's all in the name of communication so that we can get the information that you need as soon as possible. and We can communicate with you effectively. <sighs> I didn't have a checklist with me, but I think I've remembered everything. So just wanna wish you every blessing for the second Sunday of Lent. And uh, just to um, pray about those things that I've, uh, particularly the unit that I've placed upon your heart today. Wish you every God's every blessing and look forward to seeing you over this weekend or the following weeks.